Who doesn't love a good scare? Virtual reality and horror games go together like pancake and syrup. Not everybody can run out and buy the newest, shiniest VR title only to realize that it wasn't worth your money. Today's video, we are gonna be taking a look at the 10 best free VR horror games. These are in no particular order, but I did group them into categories. Universal, meaning that there is both PC versions and Quest versions, Quest standalone and PC VR only. If you find these types of videos helpful, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And let's go ahead and get right into it after a quick word from today's sponsor. This video is sponsored by Kiwi Designs, one of my absolute favorite VR accessory companies. I've been using these Quest 2 hand straps for quite some time that give you the classic valve index controller feel they are much more comfortable than your stock controller and add a lot more length for larger hands also my favorite is the quest 2 elite strap which is super comfortable and adds a massive upgrade from the stock strap that ships with the quest 2 of course links will always be in the description and make sure to use discount code joshi poshi to save yourself five percent and of course help the support of growing this channel. Number one will be VR Chat Horror Worlds. Now, I was a VR Chat hater for a long time until recently when I started playing with a few friends and discovering horror worlds like Silent Hill 2 City being recreated, as you see in this video, as well as Silent Hill PT and a few other notable horror experiences. VR Chat offers an endless collection of VR experiences by giving the power of creation to the community. There is an absolute ton of worlds, but do keep in mind that some maps may only work with PC VR. In my personal opinion, VR Chat is best when played with friends one night and setting the world instance to friends only. This will prevent any immersion breaking experiences from people joining your horror experiences. Coming in at number two, much similar to VR Chat, the other popular free social experience driven around player made content is Rec Room. Offering both a Quest and PC VR counterpart, I found myself enjoying titles like the famous Poppy's Playtime and many, many more. I don't have too much to say else about Rec Room as I actually do prefer VR Chat over Rec Room, but there are a ton of similarities between the two. Moving on to our Quest standalone games, we have Project Terminus, which isn't actually a free game, but they do have a pretty robust demo on SideQuest. If you're unfamiliar with SideQuest and installing games, leave a comment down below and I can create a guide for it. Project Terminus is a survival horror game set in Paris that you and three other friends can jump in together. You will find plenty of gripping horror experiences here that just don't include your average jump scare. The developers paid special attention to the atmosphere of the game, setting the tone for it from the very beginning. Have a fear of Mike Myers' Cat in the Hat? Well then this game is for you. Or maybe it's not. Coming in at number 4 we have Cat, which is a Quest VR horror game that is pretty straightforward. Taking a book out of Slenderman, Cat is a short game where you find and collect 6 items to activate a pentagram to get rid of the cat. He moves faster and faster and hunts you the more items that you collect. For the Five Nights at Freddy's fans, we have number five, Polar Dread. Polar Dread takes heavy, and I mean heavy influence from Five Nights at Freddy's Help Wanted, but flips it on its head. You'll be forced pulling, throwing, and rummaging through the basement looking for fresh batteries, all while hiding like a child. The game currently features three levels that are guaranteed to get you up close and personal with Slush and his gang. Moving on to the PC VR only titles, which will require a decent gaming computer and a link cable or strong enough Wi-Fi to support AirLink. We have number six, the Paranormal Hunter demo. Paranormal Hunter is a new and upcoming game that takes a lot of inspiration from Phasmophobia. The game is a co-op online ghost hunting adventure game that is extremely intense. I think overall the game is really rough around the edges and quite a few of my friends had major issues even loading into the game. At this time I would recommend just purchasing Phasmophobia, but if you are looking for a free alternative this is probably your best option. The SCP Foundation is a secret organization that is responsible for capturing and containing various paranormal, supernatural, and mysterious phenomena. 
and then containing it for the safety of civilization as well as keeping their existence completely secret. There is a ton more to the massive fan work of SCP, but it has spiraled off into quite a few successful games. At number 7, SCP Lab Rat is the faithful adaptation of the hit game SCP Containment Breach, but of course in VR. Jump in alone or play with friends and try to escape this facility full of SCPs as shit starts going south very quickly. In my opinion, this is one of the best free games on this entire list. At number 8, we have Propagation VR, a co-op based survival horror wave shooter. Propagation VR throws you right into the middle of a zombie apocalypse. Will you be able to survive massive hordes of zombies and multi-species mutants? There's only one way to find out. Do keep in mind that Propagation VR sadly does make you pay for online co-op DLC, which I don't agree with, but it is still a fantastic single player experience if that is what you're looking for, and the single player experience is completely free. If shooting zombies isn't your type of horror, but you love the work of HP Lovecraft and cosmic horror, then the VR narrative experience Dagon might be exactly what you're looking for. Dagon is more of an audiobook on steroids, as it's not much of a game, but more of a very well done point and click adventure. The voice acting is absolutely perfection, as well as the visuals, and the story is told very well. I recently did an entire playthrough and review of this game that will be coming on my channel in the future, so make sure to subscribe. And rounding out our entire list of the top free horror games, we have number 10, Losted. A rather unique demo that puts you waking up in an old castle and exploring eerie pathways and rooms while trying to regain your memory. The demo is highly immersive, using top-notch graphics and dynamic sounds. Losted does a fantastic job at immersing you into the dark corners of the human mind. Thank you guys very much for watching, stay safe, Stay scared, and we will see you next time.